What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'd like to talk about the PS5 system update for yesterday, June the 7th. Now, this is not uh, a big patch notes page from Sony, kind of like what we usually get where it's just something kind of small, but there was one thing added to this in the patch notes that I did find kind of interesting. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything uh, down in the description, the community discord, which you're all welcome to join, of course, and my Twitter. And if you haven't subbed to the channel yet, hit that sub button. And if you enjoy this video, I would appreciate a like. Now, when it comes to the normal patch notes, they improve system software performance and stability. That's pretty much what we get with every uh, PlayStation update over the years. But they also improve the messaging and usability on some screens. They really didn't go into great detail on exactly what that was. But I did notice uh, before the update, I was having some issues with messaging, joining parties, things like that. So I'm not sure if there was a bug there, if it was just... At the time, it was just something wrong with, you know, PSN, and it was just kind of a coincidence that this was in the patch notes, but they did do some improvements to messaging. And the usability on some screens, I'm really not sure what that is because I've not seen anything personally after the update that really had changed. Now, I'm hoping in the future we will get some more ease of access kind of things when it comes to usability on the screens. I kind of liked how things worked with the PS4 in some ways better than I do the PS5 when it comes to the home screen and some of the usability options we have. I really hope in the future Sony adds the option to make your own file like game folders and different folders you can use on your home screen. That way you can put your games all in one folder. I really did enjoy that uh, on the PS4. But as of right now, that's kind of all the detail Sony uh, has given us. And I'm sure we're probably not going to get any more major detail unless something really did change and people kind of find out about maybe some uh, ghost fixes that they didn't mention in this update. But if anything does come out about that, I will make a separate video. But I just want to make a quick video letting you know exactly what changed. Leave me your comments with your thoughts, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.